Hey Aries, welcome to Essential Energy 8408, where the game is to be told and never sold, baby. I am your spiritual home girl, Essential Energy. Well, I'm here to tell you the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, and so may you handle it by God's will, okay? We're going to ask that we are um, invited into God's sacred space as Holy Spirit and God and the angels are always allowed into ours, okay? If this is not your story, if it doesn't resonate, Please feel free to go look at some older videos. That may help you. But guarantee there is a message in here for you, baby. Okay? How y'all doing? How y'all feeling? I'm hearing it's a sticky situation. Whatever that may be. Okay? Because yesterday when I tried to do y'all reading, I spilled some tea on my cards. And the cards that I wanted to use for you guys' energy, they are sticky. So I cannot use them right now. So something about a sticky situation, okay? And chaos. Okay, it's a lot of distractions because I could not get y'all read it out. But anywho, my Aries, my Rams babies, how are y'all feeling? How are y'all doing? We about to just go ahead and just get a random angel message for y'all. Okay, let's see what the angels want to tell the Rams babies, the Aries, the fire sign, the warriors. Okay, I'm hearing you are a warrior. Okay. Something about the number 712, okay? Your relationships with those who are close to you are important. Remember to bring light to your current connections and relationships and workplace. The lessons you are learning and teaching must begin in your own life, okay? So something about your relationships are very significant for you. They're very um, dear, I'm hearing, to the heart, okay? Um, they're very important to you. So, you doing some type of reflection or something like that? I don't know, babies. But let me see. Let's see what's in the SB bag. What messages are in there for you guys, okay? I pray all is well with you and your families, okay? And if this shoe doesn't fit, Cinderella or Cinderfellow, please don't try to make it, okay? Take what resonates and leave the rest for whoever needs the shoe, okay? All right, SB, Holy Spirit, Spirit, what do you want to tell Aries? What does Aries need to know? Here we go with the shenanigans. They don't never, it's always some craziness, okay? Distractions. Hey, it's something about falling, a fallout, okay? A fallout. Because my camera just fell on y'all. Oh my gosh. It stresses me out. Somehow, all you do is smoke and fuck. All you do is smoke and fuck. Something to do with a birthmark, okay? A mold or something with skin, okay? Something could be going on with your skin right now, okay? It could be causing you stress or maybe because of stress okay didn't know niggas be jealous too okay somebody is jealous of you or you somebody aries okay earth angel healer okay gold digger can you pay my bills can you pay my Wait, can you pay my bills? Can you pay my telephone bills? Do you pay my automobiles? If you did, then maybe we can chill. I don't think you do, so you and me are through. So, something about a gold digger in y'all energy. Okay, either you are, feel like somebody's a gold digger or somebody feel like you're a gold digger. Okay, Aries, take it how it resonates. Or maybe this is not you. Maybe it's going on around you, okay? Something about demons, okay? Are around and in any evil eye evil thought evil intent violent negativity that's trying to come over here with evil eye i and we we turn that right back to cinder okay we're blocking any of that because it's all positive vibes over here okay we're all dope in our own unique way okay scales an air sign it could be a libra you could have libra somewhere in your chart or you're dealing with a libra or there's a libra somewhere around you Okay, they could be the gold digger or just, they think that you're the gold digger. Something about lifetime. 
I'm hearing the song by Erica Badu. You could be dealing with Pisces, have Pisces in your chart, or somebody's name is Erica, or somebody's just a, a spiritualist. I guess I'll see you next lifetime. Or you could be watching that network or watching a movie or something, or something is like a lifetime, okay? I miss our conversations. Somebody miss y'all conversations, how y'all talk, or how you listen, or you somebody, okay? What else, spirit? Know yourself, okay? You could be listening to that song by Drake, or you just trying to get to know yourself, okay, better. So, um, something about a um, homicide, okay? I had a dream, okay, about a husband and wife, and um, I had unalived somebody, so be careful, Okay, I don't know what that was about. Something about a player alert, okay? This person could be a gold digger and caught feelings, okay? So somebody caught feelings, okay? They thinking about y'all conversations. It could be a Libra or a Pisces, okay? Or it could be a gold digger somewhere around, okay? And somebody is jealous. All they wanna do is smoke and fuck, okay? Take that how I resonate. Also, this could be for the sun, moon, rising, and I'm hearing Venus and even North Node, okay? So, let's put that right here. Take what resonates, guys. This might just be something going on around with your, in your friend squad or something, okay? Something about reading and writing, okay? I'm hearing somebody um, is reading old text messages. Somebody want to reach out as well, okay? Or some, some out of... Uh, a letter or something. Somebody wants to express themselves. Spirit, what does Aries need to know? Tell me what does Aries need to know? If you knew, welcome. I love you. Okay, thank you for giving me your energy. Something about church, something to do with religion. Okay, something about uh, going to church more. Okay. Or connecting with God or talking to a pastor, a preach, a priest or something. Okay, driving. Highway, be careful with your driving. Okay. Or maybe y'all taking a trip somewhere. Going on a highway. Something about daycare. Okay. Maybe you're driving towards your kids or uh, dropping them off at daycare. Also, uh, something about... Um, Sunday school, I, I'm hearing, okay? What else for Aries? Something to do with the winter, snow, okay? Something about cold. Somebody could be cold towards, towards you or you could be acting cold towards somebody. It could be somebody that you have children with, okay? Or just somebody is being cold or something to do with the Capricorn, um, Aquarius, or a Pisces. Okay. That could be a significance. What else, Spirit, for Aries? Something about a, a vet, okay? Walking the dog, okay? Or something about um, taking your pet to the vet okay you could be commuting to take your dog even to a, a daycare or something like that okay something about counseling therapy maybe um driving you is like therapeutic for you okay a getaway or your pet could be like therapeutic for you with anxiety okay what else there for Aries? What does Aries need to know? I'm hearing um, church, therapy, talking to a pastor, okay? Something about problems.
somebody's acting real cold to the point where <clears throat> somebody needs counseling okay something about that uh homeless shelter okay maybe you work at a uh, you volunteer or work at a shelter or um maybe you um looking for a shelter you this is going to help you get a home okay or something about your home or somebody's acting cold in your home weird i'm hearing weird energy it's weird something is sticky what else thank you spirit something about salon or spa spa day okay <laughs> Your pets deserve to have spa day as well, but maybe you need to get away. Go pamper yourself, okay? Go get a massage. Go get a, your hair done, hair cut, okay? Just pamper yourself. Nails done, male or female. You get a manicure, pedicure, or just get your nails done, or just something that's relaxing, okay? Therapeutic for yourself, self-care, A nice sauna or something like that. What else, Spirit for Aries? What else do they need to know? Something about sunny summer, okay? But it's not sunny right now because it was... Um, the back was up. So something about turning your back or something during the summertime is summer where I am. Okay, so you could be, it could be summer for you. Something is not like happy. Something is cold right now. What up, spirit? Thank you. Spirit say you need to go for a walk. Okay, you need to go for a walk. Take this pet outside. I don't care if it's a bird, a cat, a, a rabbit, a dog. Okay, go outside. I'm here and go hug a tree. Go outside towards trees, okay? Because something is like weird in y'all energy. Y'all need a getaway. <laughs> you need a getaway. Take a trip, okay? Or you could have just came back from a trip, about to go on a trip, planning a trip, okay? Something about going to a stadium or watching a game. Something will do with sports or somebody's just playing games. Okay. Yeah. Something about spending time with friends. What else? Maybe needs to go swimming. Okay. Something about a concert. Somewhere they shouldn't be. Check on your pets. Okay. Because somebody, some pet is somewhere where they shouldn't be. Okay. Let me see what else I got for y'all, Aries. I have something else for y'all. We only have 12 minutes in. Something told me, Spirit told me to get these for y'all. Okay, something about lies being told. Something about fake news, okay? Something is being revealed to y'all. Here lies the, all the fucks I give, okay? Y'all putting something to rest, okay? Because lies is being told, maybe on you. Or somebody feel like you've been lying on them, okay? Something with love potions. Somebody was trying to do, like, love spells, but they have roaching-ass energy. Maybe you went cold on this person. All right, Spirit, what does Aries need to know? What does Aries need to know? Ooh, they want y'all to know a lot. Something is unforgiving. Oh. Venomous feelings, curse. It's like backfire. You turn to cinder. Somebody was trying to send y'all like bad juju hmm. someone is about to pop up on you okay this is a nymphomaniac orgy threesomes buying sex rough sex anal okay i don't know somebody's a freak <laughs> okay 
What else does Aries need to know? Somebody is angry or somebody got you upset, okay? Or something is, is like a sticky situation. Somebody also wants forgiveness, okay? From you or you, them, okay? Somebody is upset. High Priestess, somebody is using their intuition or somebody is like very tapped in with their spirituality, Okay, or it could be a Pisces energy. This high Priestess is a Pisces energy. Yeah, somebody is as prideful. But they want forgiveness, okay? They miss you. It could be a Capricorn, or they have like Pisces or Capricorn somewhere in their chart, okay? Somebody views you as an angel. It's something about your aura. They angry about it. But they miss you. They want forgiveness, but they're being prideful. You know who this is. Somebody is in regret thinking about you. Okay. Could have been. We could have been. We should have been. Somebody could be a Cancer or a Capricorn as well. Okay. Reflecting. Somebody is like remorseful. Somebody is sorry. Some about a life lesson, okay? Somebody could have damaged your property or they want to damage your property. Who the hell is this, Aries? <laughs> you are fed up with this person. You like start using your intuition. I'm hearing somebody is a spiritual hater. They don't like how tapped in you are or something like that. Like you know your worth or something. What else, spirit? This could be a twin flame. If you're not sure what that is, a twin flame is somebody that you guys are, your soul is connected as one. Okay. And it's a lot of drama. It's a lot of lessons. You both are teachers and scholars. You learn lessons or blessings, blessings from each other. Okay. Either you learn and grow or you learn and go. Okay. Somebody is on the down low. Okay. Or somebody is just angry with you on the down low. <clears throat> Something about pictures, okay? Somebody is reminiscing, thinking about y'all like memories, the past. Somebody is like is in a nostalgia state. <clears throat> you belong to me. I really don't give a fuck about them. Okay, so somebody could have been out here outside doing what they wanted to do, but they feel like you belong to them. First of all, you are the prize, never a possession. Okay, so you only belong to, yeah, this person has venomous energy. You belong to the higher power of the white light, which is God himself. You are God's child. You are not nobody's possession. Okay, yeah, somebody is struggling, handouts. <clears throat> this person could be homeless. They could be at a shelter. Okay, somebody don't like how you went cold on them. <laughs> what else for Aries? Let me get a couple more. Then I'm going to get some tarot. Then I'm going to give y'all a spiritual as fuck card. Let me get up out of here, Aries. This is just, you know, see what's going on with y'all energy. Hmm. I almost fell. Let me get a couple more spirit. Yeah, something about your spirituality. Somebody don't like how you use your intuition. Let me get one more card, spirit, for Aries, please. This person is a sweet talker, manipulate, manipulative, victimizer, and a charmer. This person plays victim. Okay, you could have moved away from this person. Okay, you could have moved into a shelter so you can get you a new home. They're trying to research you. They're trying to look you up. Okay, or maybe you guys doing like research and remember reading and writing. Spirit, what is this energy? Who is this that's angry? Somebody that's seeking karma. Somebody is angry that they're seeking karma because they were trying to do like black magic rituals or something under the moon. Okay, somebody is seeking karma. 
and they're angry about it because they can no long they can no longer like manipulate you. What are, what is this karma? Look under the moon. I told y'all somebody was doing stuff in secret, and they have you use your intuition, and they have got exposed. You start paying attention. They try to do stuff on a down low and it got exposed. I'm hearing like love. Remember love potion we saw? Trying to do love spells, keep you stuck. Six of Pentacles. You was given to this person. Six of Swords. Something about the number 66. Okay. It's 19. Somebody could be born 1966. Okay. Or something about the number 66. Somebody could be 66. But moving forward, like you moved away from this person. And this person is very angry and prideful about it. That somebody don't like this. They feel like you are theirs. What else, spirit? It could be a... a a fellow um fire sign aries leo sagittarius okay something about very being very attractive okay something about your aura okay you could be you you're very attractive is what i'm seeing as well something about sunflowers sunflower seeds sunflowers yeah somebody want to come in and and charm you like but they looking for a handout. They struggling. <laughs> Something that you did to remove yourself, it, it caused chaos in this person's life. This person is struggling. Okay? They feel like you're theirs. It was on a, a faulty foundation. It wasn't solid. Some of you have a family with this person or some someone do a family, okay? Somebody was very impulsive. It could be a baby mama, a wife, a mother figure or something like that. Somebody did something very impulsive and it created like chaos. They always got their hand out for something, okay? They see that you know how to manifest something. Like you always make things happen, Aries. Okay, King of Swords, you're very logical in your thinking, Aquarius energy. You have Aquarius somewhere in your chart. Scorpio. What else, Spirit, for Aries? What else do they need to know? Yeah, somebody see, like, you make you make stuff happen. You somebody's wish fulfillment. And they're angry because they can't manipulate you. They feel like you being prideful, but it's really them. Okay. They need a handout from you. They need something from you, Aries. They always need something. Yep. They know they see you working all the time. It could be a Sagittarius. I don't know. But somebody is trying to act like they want to come bring in balance and work on something with y'all. But Spirit's saying no. Because it's, it's something they need something from you, Aries. They're like deceptive. They're they're sneaky or something. Okay. Let me give y'all a spiritual as fuck card. So somebody is ooh. These cards flew out. These spirits, spirits want to want y'all to know a lot of stuff. Okay. Put that right there. Something about no full sentence. You know what punctuates that sentence? Action. We spend so, so much time exp, ex, explaining our boundaries that we forget to just have a fucking boundary. Say no and quit participating in what you said no to. Remove yourself from the situation if you have to. Be your own boundary. Okay? So no is a full sentence. When this person want to come, oh well, no. What would you do if I wasn't here? Okay, Aries? 
I hope this um, message finds you, help you, okay? And if this is not your story and it's going on around you, share this with somebody else, okay? So they can know what to set this boundary. Say no. I love y'all to life. I'll get back with y'all. Peace.